GG, where are we now? We are now at the terminal GT Palangkongan in uh, Terengganu. We're taking a boat. We're taking a boat. To go to the island. One of the islands here in Terengganu. I'm so excited for it because it's gonna be my first time on an island. Same. I've never been on an island in Malaysia. Except well, except Borneo, Borneo, which is True. technically a big island. But yeah, going with the laptop, on a boat, on an island. So GG, the boat is actually small. I was expecting a bigger one, but oh well. Be careful, you're standing on the side of the pier. I know, and, uh, he and has I'm a holding laptop a laptop. He's yes. working on a boat in the middle of the ocean. You see what I do for you? <laughs> you see what I do for you? Thumbs up for you, Michael. Thumbs up, and please like my video for this one. <laughs> okay, let's go with the boat. has to offer so far the sand is amazing soft and squishy I love it I completely love it let's see where we can sit where we can have some dipping okay we're going here inside actually now to leave the laptop to charge because uh, Michael is still working hi Hi! Thank you so much! Thank you! So we are right here guys on the beach our very first island here in Drenganu, Malaysia and it's really beautiful the water is super clear I still have yet to go inside and take a, take a bath here but so far so good I love the sand, it's really soft it's a yellow type of sand. It's really nice. Um, the water is pretty clear. I think you can see it. There's a lot of boats. Like this, this special island is um, really popular because it's the closest one to the city of Terengganu. I hope you guys can hear me because there are like boats all around bringing in more and more tourists, departing with tourists. So up to the, this island we spent I think maybe 30 minutes coming here on a speedboat. That was super pleasant, feeling a lot of fresh wind in the air, in the, in the face. That was beautiful. And now I can't wait to go inside the water a little bit later today. So far I'm just enjoying the waves and uh, the, the vibe here of peace and calm around. I think this is one of the perfect places to come with your family a lot of children here enjoying their time with their parents jumping around splashing in the water 
building castles in the sand really really beautiful so the beach is quite long I would say perfect for a family for a day trip just to enjoy taking some sun play in the waves and then go back to Turingan um, the huts here on the side are really pretty uh, they offer you from everything like from food coffee anything uh, you you could want like juices um, you can get refreshed and then jump inside the water and play along with the waves now we are preparing for a cooking show and this is how the set looks like today by the beach we have professional chefs we have uh, professional people here um, passionate about the Malaysian cuisine and uh, that's really really great because we have a lot of things to learn from from them and from the whole team here Gigi there's nothing nicer than cooking on a beach what do you think that's true I think that's true and oil actually is something that is nicer than cooking on a beach what? cooking on a beach with friends yes that's true that's even better so lucky we have these nice people with us for us to enjoy the cooking together Yay. so I don't know what dish they're cooking but I will tell you as soon as the dish is finished what it is because I will learn what it is because I suck at Malaysian cuisine names oh I hope I will remember till we finish the name so I can tell you too sure. perfect let's go enjoy the cooking show while the guys are cooking over there I'm hanging with Fakur and our laptop and I'm cooking also something up for you a video so keep your fingers crossed that the video is gonna finish so you will see something thank you for helping me by the way with the with the cable very amazing man without you this whole video would not be possible see very nice people here on the island amazing come to this island enjoy if you don't the fish will eat you so come and enjoy and stay here with Fakur and grab a coffee from him because his coffee is amazing what is the dish called? Uh, Tatupak Sotong. Tatupak Sotong. Yeah. <laughs> hey, I made it on the first try. <laughs> Very good. Tatupak Sotong. Tatupak Sotong. Yeah. Okay. Nice. Yeah. Looks a bit milky. Yeah, it's it's milk. Milk. Coconut. Oh, oh. Coconut milk. Oh. We're gonna have some good fun tonight. <laughs> coconut, coconut milk. milk. <laughs> not cow milk. Okay, coconut milk. <laughs> Perfect. Yeah. Looking forward to eating it. Yeah, to get some of the sauce. Okay. Now I take some saucy sauce. I take some fishy fish. Okay, so you mind just holding it up for the camera? Okay, okay. Just hold the... Okay. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mm-hmm. Hot. Mm-hmm. <laughs> <laughs> awesome. Mm -hmm. Perfect. It's very good, but it's super hot. But it's amazing. The coconut is wow. melting my heart inside. Wow. Very good. Amazing. amazing. I can hardly wait to eat more. A few last photos. The soup is really good. The sauce. Oh, it's so hot. Welcome to my life, Gigi. Mm -hmm. The squid is crunchy. I love it. One, two, three. One, two. I, I would have a little bit of salt with it or some sambal. I think that would be great. Uh, yeah, yeah. Mm. Awesome. You know, the food is good when it doesn't even reach the table. I mean, already everybody took from the pot, and now I think there's only one sotong left. Oh, wow. Mm -hmm. Set up gila. Very good. Very good. <laughs> Terima kasih, chef. Terima kasih. Perfect. Perfect way to spend the afternoon in the sun on a beach near Terangano. 
Amazing. You steam the, the sweet. The sticky rice. The sticky rice. You steam it until it cooks. And then you just make the, the, sauce. the sauce. So you make it separately. Simple. But I like the yeah. sauce with the soto yeah. in there because you do get the sweetness, sweetness of, the of the squid. Yeah, the coconut goes sweet. into the squid. Yeah, yeah. yeah. The That's like better. Sweeter. Very short Maybe you guys are very better than me at describing food. <laughs> Way better than me. Yeah, that's, what, that's what you get for being Malaysian. Yeah. <laughs> you guys actually love food. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Maybe if you don't have a, a fresh squid, you can do that. Otherwise, it will touch out the taste. Yeah, no? yeah, I'll, I'll, I'll. yeah? Uh, I think. Okay, I thought so. Okay. Ah. So we're trying to try Boleh, boleh, boleh. Yes, it's very mild. Yeah. Mm. I've had the Kelantan version, which used brown sugar or the oh. coconut sugar, and that was quite sweet. I, I, I think I like this, this one better. Nice. Yeah, this one's very nice. Just right. Quite sort of, yeah. yeah. This white up. Just right. I only tried this one, so I like this one better. <laughs> <laughs> I'm hunting water monitors. Hey, hey, hey. Went away. No. Let's go swimming. Let's go swimming. How is the water? Oh, it's nice. Very nice. <laughs> By the way, shout out to Mr. Zicarno and Madame Stady. <laughs> sea monster! Sea monster! More, more returning my hat. The hat lid. I am your father, Gigi. I shall come and teach you the ways of the force. <laughs> teach you the ways of the force of the fish. <laughs> of the fish of the force. Of the fish of the force. Of the force. Let's go explore for fish. Shall we? <laughs> Let's go. <laughs> Let's go. Let's go. I found one fish. <laughs> big one. Yes, yes. Okay, Attempt number one in looking for fish. <laughs> I don't know, some tropical colored uh -huh. fish. Uh, there's sea urchins. Uh -huh. uh, obviously, lots of sea cucumbers. Uh -huh. uh, and then a lot of these wool guards over here. Perfect. Let's see. Thank you. 
I like that, yes, I found some fish. I'm so happy. I found a rainbow fish, I found a zebra fish, I found a yellow fish. Yes. So many pretty fish. Oh. <laughs> yes, that was a fish ticket. Okay, I'm tired of snorkeling. Let's go back to the shore. Okay, cool. I want to and enjoy. enjoy. Okay, have fun. So, Gigi, what do you think about Kapas Beach? Do you like it? I love it. Is it nice? I absolutely loved it. I mean, here you can stay here, but a lot of tourists are gonna come in, so you can roam around the island, and you're gonna find the best, best beach where we spent a lot. Of yes, time. there's a lot of beaches around here. There's a lot, uh, not only this one. You just have to go out your comfort zone and explore, and go through the jungle also if you want to, and then you will find more beaches. And the people here are amazing. They even have a one piece flag, DG. Yes. Actually, two of them. Two of them. Ah, oh, yes. Yes. Super cool. And kapas technically is supposed to mean cotton or something, if I remember correctly, because they say that the sand here is like cotton, soft like cotton. Oh, yes. On that beach where we were, definitely. Yes, numbers. for sure. And this one too, but this is more transitive. What was the favorite activity of today for you? Snorkeling. Snorkeling the fish. Uh -huh. Yes, the fish were amazing. I hope you guys will enjoy the video too. Yes. Enjoy it. Enjoyed it already. Yes. And I know, depending how how we're gonna edit it, it depends. Thank you guys so much for watching. Thank you. The um, fish, thank you. Gigi, thanks you. I thank you. And what did you want to say, Gigi? And don't forget to subscribe, like, comment, share the slow so that more people can come here. Yes, to visit Kapas and this wonderful beach and this wonderful people. So, have a wonderful evening, guys. For us, it's time to go. Take the boat, one of them over there, and return back to the mainland. So, see you in the next video. Bye bye. Oh, and the squid adventure continues. Ooh. <laughs> sneaky sneaky okay bye